What up Long Beach? Welcome back to your home for everything local sports. It's JJ. This highlight video is brought to you by the fine folks down at Naples Rib Company. All of our Wilson Athletics coverage is sponsored by alum Joel Batonio and all of our aquatics coverage here at the 562.org is sponsored by the Aquatic Capital of America. More League Boys water polo going up on a Tuesday. Got a game with some bop in it. The Belmont Outdoor Pool is our site. Wilson hosting Milliken. The upstart Rams are hungry for a marquee win, trying to knock Wilson off the top of that league ladder. But Zach's pack is ready to attack the Bruins, closing in on a 17th straight league title. Wilson goes right to work, scores on its first possession. Keegan Abing finds Samson Kasem, works for some space with some style and grace. Kids got handles, Bruins got the lead, and they wouldn't lose it. Milliken goalkeeper Mazin Mendoza and his defense, they were good early. He had seven saves and needed them. The Rams showed some good fight that got praised by the Wilson coaches and players after this game. Speaking of good goalkeeping, Wilson's got two quality cage minders in Christian Marov Perez. He had five saves in the first half, and Andrew Dombrowski, who made a few saves in the second half. They've been sharing time all season, and you can read more about these best friends in our article at the562.org. Wilson up 4 nothing in the second quarter. How about this magic bullet from Evan Mariski? I mean, it's not exactly a buttery sniper, but it still counts when Wilson shares the ball like this. I gotta be honest, they're tough to beat. Kasem with the dot. Von Baker, the loud goal maker with authority. And then a little bit later, I can't believe this one went in. I mean, Gavin Simon says the tight angle ain't no thing. Squeezes it home as nine different Bruins would score goals in this one, including Keegan Abing, a junior who can play on the right side and in the middle. He just got a good feel for the game. And like this play, he said that high water polo IQ is aided by good chemistry with his teammates, knowing when things are coming, when they're going to do things. Well, it helped him score two goals and assist on three other ones in the first half alone. I mean, a bada bing right into your living room. He is a special player. Wilson got a few of them, and there's a reason why they are what they are. Milliken got goals from Nathan Huber and Zane Dadul, but this day belongs to the Bruins. 15-2 is your final. Wilson takes on Jordan and Polly to finish the season, while Milliken will take on Cabrillo, Jordan, and Polly to finish the year off. For all of that local water polo coverage and everything else, local sports, you stay right here at the562.org.